Today we will be going and fixing the Off-White Air Force One mid. This brand new shoe is releasing tomorrow and it definitely has a few interesting touch points. So today I will be editing this shoe to make it how I believe it should originally look. So one thing that they've been going and adding recently are these strange spikes on the front and the middle of the shoe which just aren't really comfortable. Why are they adding like these track spikes in the middle of a shoe, which they know most of their audience won't want. So what I'm gonna go and do is actually go and remove all of these spikes. Since having these doesn't really work well, it just makes the shoe uncomfortable to walk with. The reason why Nike's been going and using this is because of the ISPA collection, standing for Improvise, Scavenge, Protect and Adapt. So basically Nike is going and collecting these random other materials that they don't normally use and trying to include it into the design. What I'm going to go and do is add some hints of colour as there's this nice selection of three colours featured in the sole of the shoe. So I thought, you know what, if they're going to feature some crazy colours, why don't they feature it in the rest of the model? So currently we've gone and removed the spikes and started to adapt this area. We're going to go and colorize the shoelaces so it matches the top half of the midsole using this nice green tone. Already I think this shoe kind of looks more comfortable. What I'm now going to go and do is fill out the gaps where all of these spikes were to make it an even tread. Because if not, you guys are going to be walking very funny. Maybe it could have been nice to see some colour blocking on the upper where we'd be featuring this segment as the different tones. Since the sole is very colourful, I believe the rest of the shoe should kind of match that. Maybe it could be this all pink colour, or they go for this nice blue all over. Personally, I think that this model looks a lot nicer than what they originally showed, which features these spikes, not much hints of colour anywhere else. And this is how, if I was to go and design the shoe, I would have gone and changed it. 